Welcome back to Good Morning Vail. Jennifer Lenz is joining me now from By Nature Gallery. They've got a beautiful, your place is amazing. It's just right there, uh, one level up from the ice rink in Beaver yeah. Creek. Uh, but you came down to the studio today to, to showcase some of the beautiful things that mm -hmm. you have. And this is honestly just a tiny, tiny smattering of what's available. Tell us just about By Nature. Just a little tease here. Of, it is full on a tease. Yeah, of all of our amazing fossils and minerals and home decor and uh, the full price range, the full size range, the full um, taste range. I really have something to suit everybody, including the kids. Items starting at just a dollar. You have the uh, the uh, what do you call that crunchy? The geo cracker. Yeah, yeah. So you get a little geode. You never know what you're going to find inside. Yeah. And each one's different. Yeah, and we actually just got in some five-inch jumbo geodes lately that we've cracked a few of that are absolutely insane. So you know, not just the customers, but we totally nerd out and get super excited about all of our all of our good stuff and too. you should yeah what's the biggest thing you have in there right now is don't you have like a giant skull or a, that was a, last year that was last i just you need to come in no i'm just kidding i have, have a t-rex skull i know you do hanging in the window right now but it's a replica it's the only replica in the whole gallery so it's okay it's still <laughs> cool it's yeah still it's awesome. a nice eye catcher so when you're hanging out on the ice rink if you look, you look up, up one level yeah. yeah then you can see the t-rex hanging in the window and then it gets down to nice and small stuff yeah also. yeah and we've got really big petrified wood tables i have a, a giant sequoia petrified wood table that's um just over five feet in diameter oh wow yeah it's awesome okay let's talk okay, about some what of you our, brought in I today i just brought a little red white and blue taste over Cute. here carnelian and quartz and lapis just pretty stand-ups people put them on carnelian uh-huh people put them on their you know bookshelves on their desks on their coffee tables whatever you want to do with it they're just pretty minerals from all over the world oh they're beautiful yeah i think madagascar brazil and maybe afghanistan is what i'm representing with my little american red white and blue <laughs> selection over there got some pretty neat stuff they have a lot yeah let's go right here i miss the sand this, art everybody I love this thing. yeah everybody always goes gaga for i've got smaller ones and much bigger ones as well Every time you flip the sand picture, you get a different scene. You get a different um, visual yeah. on that. Well, I'm going to hey hold it up like hey that now. so we can see it better. Um, there we go. Get, take the glare off it. There oh, it is. Oh, good. Yeah, and this one has a photo in the background of, you know, outer space kind of thing. <laughs> so it feels like you're standing on another, not a photo, sorry, a rendering. Um, maybe it is a photo. Uh, it feels it's like cool. you're on another planet anyhow. And some beautiful glitter in there. And it's just cool. It's, it all depends on how the bubbles trap the sand, what the next Everyone's image gonna be is different. going That's to right. be. Yeah. That's right. Okay, let's move along over here to this piece right here. This here. is a Canadian ammolite. Um, it's an ammonite that we have tons of in the gallery, but where these fossilized, um, they the shell actually mineralized, essentially opalized in the ground. So you get that amazing plethora of colors. This one's really red, but you can see little reflections of there of green and yellow, and sometimes you even get purple and blue on some of them. Wow. Yeah, and then a little custom stand by our favorite Colorado metal sculpture artist. <laughs> Who's that? Um, his name is James Valona. Thanks, James Valona. Yeah. Okay. And then now let's actually, move on to this instead beautiful. of Go that, ahead. I'd rather talk about my necklace. Talk I'm having it. a jewelry trunk show on Monday afternoon, three to seven p.m of a local jewelry artist that lives here in the valley and we've got a great selection of of her jewelry including this insane labradorite and smoky quartz necklace That's that really i'm wearing beautiful. yeah and we also have some dinosaur bone jewelry um, from the morrison formation that dates back 140 million years from her as well so colorado dinosaur bone by colorado jewelry artist how did she it's get like her hand perfect. on some of those dinosaur bones how do she you, how do you bought it from the guys that are wow. digging it up out of the ground how yeah cool. yeah it's a lot of fun so She's a blast. She can make jewelry for you right on the spot, match your, your coloring and your See. face shape and everything like that. And she'll make something that looks fabulous. She has on a you. piece of dinosaur bone that can match my face shape. Yes. Actually, I do have a couple dino bone um, men's necklaces. So. That's amazing. Yeah. Okay, we have some time. Let's talk about okay, this piece. The though, Labradorite. This is really neat. Yeah, Labradorite. So this is also a Labradorite? Labradorite, same as my necklace, which I wanted to bring in because it's a totally. The, my necklace is more of the blues, and this big piece is more of the like goldy yellow, orange. You get flashes of green in there as well. Um, again, Madagascar. That's five and a half kilograms of beauty right there. Yeah, exactly. So it's like a 12 pound chunk of giant, beautiful <laughs> rock. It, Labradorite is actually um, like a gray stone but it has all these wonderful you know fracture lines in it and it reflects refracts light in it and it usually refracts that kind of blue or green light 
Wow. So when you look at it, which is why when you turn it, you get the different colors because it's the, how the light is reflecting. And depending it. upon which light rays, what color yeah. rays are coming into it. Yeah, I, I, it was fun actually yesterday, again, nerding out. We have a couple different pieces. I don't see you guys doing that out there for some reason. What? Nerding out? I'm kidding. I'm so kidding. <laughs> um, I can see that more than We have a couple anything. different pieces, and it, some of them look good at this height, and some of them look good at this height, yeah. and some of them look good when they're flat. So it was like, all right, I have to find the right piece. So it's fun depending upon where you're going to put something in your house. You know, we can find something that reflects the light the right way. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. Nerd. Go nerd out with these guys at By Nature Gallery. What are your hours? Um, 10 a.m. till 7 p.m. And you're open every day? Yeah. And you're right there at Beaver Creek, one yes. step up from the ice rink. You see the fountain, you'll see the, the little waterfall. You just got to stop by there and, yeah. and check out to the crew. Bring the whole family. All right, Ty's got your weather coming up next.